Hey guys, welcome back to Dark Angel Beauty. Thank you so much for tuning in today. We just knocked out all of the March subscription boxes in terms of filming those. And now I am on my way to filming a haul that I purchased, let's see. So today is March 21st, just to keep that in perspective. I made this purchase on February 3rd of 2020. So it has been a month and a half, almost two months. We'll call it two months since I've ordered this um, because I'm a mess. Uh, <laughs> So we kept saying we needed to film it and then we haven't been filming a lot lately and we've just been crazy and they're buying a house and now coronavirus is here. And so it's just been wild. So it, it, it's been a long time coming. This is a really cool haul in my opinion because I bought, I had a 20% off coupon. It was the Diamond Perk Day where they give you a bunch of extra free stuff if you're a Diamond or a Platinum member. And then I also have a ton of points. So I opted to get, I used my coupon I got all the free gifts that I could and I used points and I wound up paying total for this order, 95 cents out of pocket. So I was very proud of it. And the fact that I haven't recorded it yet is kind of sad, but yes. So the retail value of everything before discounts, before anything, it was $157 and 36 cents. And like I said, I paid 95 cents for it. Let us jump into what I purchased. Everything I was buying was pretty much either on sale or some of it was new or I was getting a free gift. So yes, so the first thing is we're gonna do a whole separate video unboxing this, but this is the diamond perk free gift that we got. I had to spend at least $125, which is why I bought so much. Um, and it is just slam packed, filled with stuff. I love the case so much, such a cute case, really, really um, good in terms of the storage, like size of it. And like I said, it is slam filled with all these kind of stuff that I got for free. So we're gonna do a whole unboxing like we would for Ipsy or BoxyCharm or something like that in the video after this. But um, but yeah, so that was a free gift. I The motivation behind making this purchase was I was actually like almost flat out of powdered face makeup and we'd gone in store to look for some and I couldn't find any that was a good deal. And then I found these. So the Ulta ones are buy two, get two free. And they are $14 a piece. So I got four for $28 which means I paid $7 a piece for them. And they're just like a nice little uh, adjustable coverage foundation is what they call it. So basically depending on how much you use, you can decide how much um, coverage you're getting with it. I actually use it as a setting powder for my liquid makeup, my liquid foundations normally. So that's why I like to have these. I don't use a ton of them normally, but I do like them to go and set, especially throughout the day. If I get oily and stuff like that, I just put a little bit more on and it helps add a little bit more coverage and also suppresses that oil. So I got four of those and I did pick those up in the shade Light Cool, which is the same shame, the same shade that I use in the um, concealers as well. The next thing that I picked up, they were actually on sale as well. They were, they were on sale for like $5 and they were normally like six or $7, something like that. Or it was like three for 20, I don't remember, but it's the, <laughs> I don't remember, it's been so long. It's the Fit Me uh, Poreless Powder from Maybelline in the shade Fair Ivory. So this is, this is also a powder foundation technically, but I think it's more of a setting powder than what that is, which is an adjustable coverage one. And I picked those up just to give myself a couple extra options in terms of like what I was using powder wise. And I also got this uh, nice little free Colossal Mascara from Maybelline for spending $15 with them. So that was, that was also a nice little benefit. This is the last free thing I got. So for this particular day, they were doing, once again, as a diamond reward, you could get the free diamond, oh no, I can't read, my God. The, the free uh, most loved matte eyeshadow palette from Milani with any $15 Milani purchase. So this was the free palette I got. So I got this one completely free and it has some gorgeous colors in there. It reminds me a lot of some old Stila palettes that I have that I, um, I got forever ago when I was first getting into makeup for my mom but it's just really gorgeous neutral shades. They're mattes, which you guys know I love my matte shades. I like glitters and stuff, but I normally try and go with matte shades. So that is why I chose that. And the one that I purchased, I spent $19.99, so $20. And I basically got two palettes, so each one was essentially $10. And I picked up the Milani Gilded Nude, which I had wanted anyway. And it also just has a lot of gorgeous, very neutral shades in it. I really love this detox, like almost silver with like gold highlight in it. I love it. It's just gorgeous in my opinion. So I got both of those. Remind you, I have had this for two months and I haven't touched any of these because I've been waiting to film this. So it's, they've just been sitting in the filming area and I'm like, 
we need to do that so I can actually use them. So uh, hopefully I'll be able to film, especially while we're sanctioned off at home, I'll be able to film some, some tutorials and first impressions with all these palettes. Um, there's a lot that I need to do though. So I won't make any promises because I've been very bad about filming this, this little while. So the next thing, this is basically, I bought all this stuff because one, I wanted them. And two, I was trying to get to $125. So here we are. Um, and I did strategically plan it so that I would spend what I needed to, to after the coupon be right at 125. So then I could use points for it, which is how I ended up only paying 95 cents. So it was very strategic in terms of what I was buying, the coupon helped. And then obviously the incentives of the free gifts also helped, but that was the, the thought process behind it. It was extreme coupon in, in that moment. And that was what occurred. So, so yeah, so BH Cosmetics happened to have released a whole buttload of palettes around this time. And I love BH Cosmetics. So I was like, I'm gonna buy them all. So the first one I picked up was this uh, Illuminating in Ireland highlight palette. And they're just so precious. They're just lovely. They're just, I love BH Cosmetics. If you haven't used BH Cosmetics, I highly recommend them. They are so affordable. They are so great. They, I just love them. I do, I love them. Um, this palette is $16. So with a coupon, I paid $12.80 for the palette. Um, the next thing I got is the Trendy in Tokyo palette from BH Cosmetics. And it is a very vibrant, just absolutely beautiful colored palette, which I always love to have those like really bold aesthetics. Cause you never know, like one, sometimes I'm just like, frick it. I'm going to go do like a bold eye look today and I don't care who, who sees it. And sometimes I'm also trying to do it for special occasions, you know, Valentine's day or St. Patrick's day or whatever the holidays maybe where I want to have some sort of a statement eye look. Um, so yeah, that one was also $16. And like I said, with a discount, it wound up being 1280 moving right along. One of our best videos in terms of like watch time and people number of views and all of that is the um, BH Cosmetic, co Cosmetic, the BH Cosmetics. It was like a little, ugh, I'm trying to remember what it was called, like the jewel palette or something like that. Well, this is the next version of that. It is called Digital Future. And it's the same t cute little like mini palette. And it was $12 originally. And it comes with all these precious little shades. And so with a discount, it was 960. I love it. I love it. It's just got like all these cool, like it's very neutral and then you got the bolds and I love the bolds. So that's what I love a, a palette that can give me both. All right, we got two palettes left. Both are from BH. Um, the next one that I'm gonna show you guys is the, I don't know if I can pronounce this word, but I'm gonna try my, my, my dangdest to do so. The La Vie Don Prince uh, shadow palette. It is a, um, that's what it looks like. That's the word. If you can tell me how to pronounce it, that, then please do. Um, but it is, very lovely. Once again, it's got literally a whole row of vi like vibrant aesthetic colors and then a whole row of neutral. And I just, I love it, everything about it. Um, it. I love the packaging on it. I just, I don't need these. Like a lot of these colors I'm probably very, I could dupe with each other, but I just was like, I don't care. I was trying to, I was trying to get my free stuff. So I was, I was, I was just throwing it in my cart and going, let's do this. And the last thing I got is the Crystal Zodiac palette. I have the original Zodiac palette and I really like just everything about it, the aesthetic, the idea behind it. But this is like the crystals that go along with your birth month. And I love that. So I'm a, I'm a diamond and I don't know if they have it. I think they're actually technically the ones that go along with your birth, with the astro astrological sign. So it's not necessarily month, it's the sign and more or so. But they've got like all these really beautiful colors. You've got amethyst that I love. You've got jade, which is a really beautiful green shade. And then you've got a bunch of neutrals as well. And then you have a really big highlight shade in the center, which you can use either as a highlighter or as like a like an eye highlighter as well. So I was really excited to get that one as well. And this is a pricier one. These, um, the Zodiac palettes are one of their most expensive palettes that they have in their collection. This one, I believe he was 27. So he's 21 after the discount. So that is everything that I picked up. It was a ton of stuff. And when you really think that I paid less than a dollar for it, it's insane. Now, don't get me wrong. I, I absolutely understand. Like I had coupons. I've been saving points for ever. So like I put in a lot of money to earn those points, but still it's really nice. That is why I continue to say it. That is why I've had issues with Ulta in the past with some of their practices I have issues with. I just, I will not ever say that they're perfect, but overall their reward system is so amazing in, in so many ways that I just continue to be a dedicated shopper there. Um, as we're filming this, it is 21 days of beauty with coronavirus going on right now. I'm not really ordering anything cause I don't really, 
one, I don't wanna make it harder for people who are trying to get medical supplies and things like that. The UPS, FedEx, the post office, they're all still working and they're all still like dealing, which is crazy stuff right now. And also there's part of me that's a little wor bit worried about receiving packages because you never know who's handled them. So it's just kind of a weird time and I'm not really doing a whole lot of buying. Maybe I'll buy a couple things, but there hasn't been a lot that I've seen right now that I've been like, oh my God, I have to get that. So, um, so yeah, so it's helped my wallet a little bit, but it's also kind of sad because I'm very far from being diamond for next year. So I need to work on that. So uh, that's it. We are going to film, like I said, a video where we just dive into this bad boy. We're gonna film that as soon as we finish this one. But for this video, that is all we have for you today. So I hope you guys have a wonderful day and you stay girly with a dark twist.